Welcome to our exploration of dredging, a process that plays a pivotal role in maintaining our waterways and supporting various industrial activities. Today, we delve into the history, significance, and challenges of dredging, a practice that has evolved significantly over time. Dredging is the art of removing sediments, debris, and other materials from the bottom of water bodies like rivers, lakes, harbors, and oceans. This process is crucial for maintaining the depth of waterways, ensuring safe navigation for ships, and controlling floods. Over time, sedimentation naturally occurs, reducing water depth and impeding vessels, making dredging an essential operation to clear channels and maintain ports. Historically, dredging was a labor-intensive process, relying on manual methods and rudimentary tools. As we journey through time, we see the evolution of dredging techniques from simple hand tools to the sophisticated machinery used today. This evolution has not only increased efficiency, but also expanded the scope of dredging to include land reclamation and environmental remediation. Navigational safety is one of the primary reasons for dredging. By maintaining the depth of channels and harbors, dredging ensures that large ships can pass safely, preventing accidents and facilitating global trade. Imagine the bustling ports of the world, from Rotterdam to Singapore, where dredging is a constant necessity to accommodate the ever-growing size of modern vessels. Flood control is another critical application of dredging. By managing water flow and reducing sediment buildup, dredging helps mitigate the risk of flooding in rivers and coastal areas. This is particularly important in regions prone to heavy rainfall and rising sea levels, where effective water management can prevent devastating floods. Land reclamation is a fascinating aspect of dredging, where dredged material is used to create new land or restore eroded coastlines. Countries like the Netherlands and Singapore have mastered this art, transforming their landscapes and expanding their territories through innovative dredging techniques. Environmental remediation is another significant purpose of dredging. By removing contaminated sediments, dredging improves water quality and protects aquatic life. This is especially important in industrial areas where pollution has compromised the health of water bodies. However, dredging is not without its challenges. The process can disrupt habitats, increase water turbidity, and release pollutants from disturbed sediments. Proper disposal of dredged materials is critical to avoid environmental harm. Modern dredging techniques have made significant strides in minimizing these impacts, with technology advancements allowing for more precise and environmentally friendly operations. Mechanical dredging, using cranes and buckets, is ideal for coarse materials, while hydraulic dredging, using suction pumps, is suited for finer sediments like sand and mud. These methods have been refined over the years, balancing efficiency with environmental considerations. Despite its challenges, dredging remains essential for maintaining shipping routes, managing floods, reclaiming land, and supporting environmental restoration. The advancements in technology have not only improved the efficiency of dredging, but also reduced its ecological footprint, ensuring that we can continue to benefit from this vital process while protecting our environment. As we conclude our journey through the world of dredging, we hope you have gained a deeper appreciation for this indispensable process. From ensuring navigational safety to supporting environmental restoration, dredging is a testament to human ingenuity and our ability to adapt and innovate in the face of challenges. Thank you for joining us in exploring the importance and challenges of dredging. We invite you to share this knowledge and continue the conversation about how we can balance industrial needs with environmental stewardship. Until next time, Stay curious and keep exploring.